In Excel, when two tables are stacked one above the other, inserting a column usually affects both. In this video, I'll show you how to insert columns in each table independently without affecting the other one. In this sheet, you can see I have two tables and I want to make some changes in both of them. Now, if I try to insert a column here, you will see my second table will also get affected and this is what I do not want. So let me show you the smartest way to do this. First of all, place your cursor on any text filled cell and press Ctrl A and then press Ctrl T. And check this box, my table has headers and press OK. In a similar way, go to second table, press Ctrl A, press Ctrl T and check this header, my table has headers and press OK. Now, let's say I want to insert column here, go to this cell, right click on it, go to insert and then select table columns to the left. And here you can see a new column has been inserted in table 1 without affecting the table sitting below to it, okay? So let's add some information here. Let me type positions and here let's quickly type the positions. Okay. In a similar way, we can also make changes in table 2. Let's say go to this, right click on it, click on insert and let's select table columns to the left and here we can add unit price. Let's quickly insert a formula here. Now if you want to change the table design, you can go to table tools and select any formatting from here. For this, let me choose this. And in order to remove these filter signs, you can just press Ctrl Shift and then right arrow and then press Ctrl Shift L. Similarly, press Ctrl Shift right arrow and then press Ctrl Shift and L. So here you can see how quickly we can make changes in both the tables so if you like the today's video, then don't forget to hit like, drop a comment and subscribe to my channel. Stay tuned for more interesting videos.